three gym badges now. Uh, I need a thingy for this. A projector. That's what I need. So I can play it. Oh, needed this. <laughs> needed this relaxing uh, uh, gameplay tonight. Oh, we're here. I remember where we are now. Right, I think we've just healed. Pretty sure we've just healed. There you go, that's a bit better. Yeah. We've definitely just healed. We've got our Gyarados, which is good. Which is excellent. And now we are on our way to a place. Oh, I wish it gave me an option to automatically thing in. Did I run here? Like, was there a panic run? Hey, I developed Bruce, how you doing? It's good to see you. Like what you do with your hair. Uh Pokemons. No 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 no. Pocket monsters. My microphone sounds very loud in my ears. Don't know what that's all about. I know what that's all about. All of my audio settings are fucked. Did I fight all of these or did I just make a beeline because I was I was battered? I'll find out. No, I think I fought them all. You also like what I do with my hair. Very shiny things. That's uh, fresh dome wax, that is. Yeah, I can hear a, a weird noise in the background. And at this point, I don't know if it's the cable that my earphones are plugged into. It's my ears. It's the game. I don't even know anymore. <laughs> are you... I got you, didn't I? Yeah, I got you. I got you too. I got them all. I got them all. Just like the, the, the game says. I got I to gotta beat them all up. <laughs> it's 100% what they say. This entire setup needs a proper overhaul. My audio situation is not is not as hard as it could be. <laughs> it's definitely not bringing its A game. I've been to a Pokemon gym a few times, but I lost each time. Well, I hate to break this to you. La trainer, trainer lady, junior trainer lady. I've been to three Pokemon gyms and I have won each time because we don't count it when we lose. I mean, come on. All right, Gyarados. Uh, yes, I need to very quickly remember what I'm doing. Fighting Pokemons. <laughs> We're going to, oh, we're going to Lavender Town. That would be good. That would be very good. Junior Train is about to go Café Levelly. Café Levelly. Do 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 do. Café Levelly. Do 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 do. I'm being up kids. I'm being up kids for their money. What can I say? It's it's in. It, it's not in my nature at all. How much lunch money does she have? We'll find out in a second. Uh, level 20 Clefairy, level 22 Paris. Paris also has Body Slam, which I'm very pleased with. <laughs> my attack fell. Body Slam. Ow. Fine then, use. Uh, ooh, yeah, I was going to say use Stun Spore because that's the, the OP move that we've got. Double slap. <laughs> Hit three turns. I dug a hole. You missed me because I'm in a hole. I used the dig. Oh, it's rubbish. Cut. Cut it in half. Cut it till it bleeds. Go ahead. It did look like a critical. I missed. Come on. Don't fall asleep. Don't do. Don't do that to me. Don't do this to me. No, I, I can't believe you've done this. I honestly cannot believe you have done this. Burn it to death. <laughs> ember. That's what we need. A good old embering. We're overdue for an ember, I think. Uh, how much lunch money did we gain? Let's see. Hold up our ankle, shake her upside down. 400 monies. That's what we got. We got four. I don't know what the exchange rate is, but 400 monies. Considering a potion is like 70 or something like that. Rock tunnel. Now, I gotta look at the map because I don't remember. My brain is still altered quite. Oh, I put the time. My brain is still quite altered from the ending of Slay the Princess, so I'm getting 
getting my brain back into gear. Oh, and he flashed, don't I? Potion 200. I don't know. I don't know. No, didn't mean to press that one. Um, I don't think any of these know flash. I think I've left flash because I didn't need it. <laughs> and now I need it. So let's go have a look at this. Beep, 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 beep. Um, mine's the item one? Yeah, mine's the item one. Good. Withdraw item. Oh, Lord. Which HM is flash? I think it's HM5. It smells like it's HM5. I'm pretty sure HM1 is cut. Uh, oh, no. I keep pressing... Why does it have a sepia mode? <laughs> don't understand. <laughs> Right, use this. It's flash. Good. Can anyone here use it? No. <laughs> God. <laughs> I'm going to have to find a Pokemon that can use flash now. This be my flash Pokemon. Um, Bill's PC. Access Bill's PC. Withdraw Pokemon. There are no Pokemon in PC. Fuck. Right, okay. Potion's about like 300. Oh, okay. Oh, I was way wrong. Um, what can use flash? What can use flash? Come in. There must be something here. This is this is an opportune moment game to do some fantastic environmental signposting. Get the the Pokemon Pocket Monster I need here. Can can Pidgey? Can Spearow use flash? Yes or no? Gen one Pokemon that can use flash. Come on, Bulbapedia, where are you? Oh, there you are. <laughs> Uh, Flash. No, Abra. Oh, Drowsy. I didn't pick up a Drowsy earlier, did I? Voltorb. Um, a Mew, of course. <laughs> just, just whip out my Mew. Um, Alright, get rid of this. Bite it. Oh, I should use Thundershock. That would be a much better one. So, Pikachu, Clefairy, Jigglypuff, Venonat. I'll take a Venonat. Not the Spiro. Not, not too keen on all the Spiro. I have my own Spiro, thanks, though. Um, quickly evolve, evolve up a Butterfree. I probably could. When does Butterfree evolve? Gem one, gem one, gem one, gem one, gem one. You teach me nothing about this. You fuck. <laughs> nothing, nothing at all. Gen one decks. Wow, there's a lot of information I don't need on this page. Whoa. Ten. Level ten. That's it. Oh Jesus. Yeah, I'll just grab a. I'll just grab a cappy. What route am I on? I'm so lost. I, I'm completely... Normally I'd take it, but no. Um, I'm near Rock Tunnel. That's where I am. Canto Map. Game Boy. Game Boy Canto Map. No, I don't want... No, no, don't do that. <laughs> I just want, in, like, an interactor. This one's fine. This That's fine. Rock Tunnel. Rock Tunnel. Rock Tunnel. Rock Tunnel. I'm on Route 9. That's where I am. That's where you all know. Route 9. Po pocket Moonsters. Sandwich. Get in there and make me a sand slash. Uh, route 9. What can we get? What can we get in Route 9 in Gen 1? Pokemon, Gen 1. Uh, Rattata, Rattata, Raticate, Spiro, Spiro, Ekin, Sandshrew, Nidoran, Nidoran, Nidoran. Well, that's bobbins, isn't it? That's absolute bobbins. Where else do we need? What are we near? I'm near uh, Route 24 and 25. That's what I'm near. I'm near Route 5 as well, but I don't think I can get through to Route 5 yet. Wait, hang on, hang on.
hang on a minute. Give me a map. If I'm searching for maps. I don't really want that that one. There. That's where I want to be. Right, I'm gonna try something really dumb. I'm gonna try and do it without flash. <laughs> Uh, this is a family friendly stream. No flash in here. Uh, okay. This is either going to go great or horrific. And I'm not sure which it's going to be. Uh, where do I go in? I don't know how I go in. I have a map now. So. What's the worst that could happen, right? I get a bit lost, I reload it. Right, I'm there. So, one. Pokemon fight, let's go. <laughs> this is so entertaining, I'm sure. <laughs> Cubone! Another of the saddest Pokemons. Uh. Oh, Splash. No, no, Splash isn't an offensive attack. Oh, my days. Oh. Focus, Smith. Focus. Oh, that's not really going to do. I have a feeling I may have chosen the wrong quick one here. Um, tackle? Eh. Bone Club, but it doesn't affect characters. That's, that's fair enough. Um... This is definitely not going to work, but it's probably more... Oh, it doesn't fit at all. Okay. Wait, Thunderbolt. I thought Thunderbolt was an offensive move, not a status move. I thought that was Thunder Wave that was a status. Wow, like, Bite does not do anything to keep up, does it? But I'm going to resist. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I'm going to pull. I'm, I'm just... Come on. I'm going to take you out. Come here. Go eradicate. Eradicate it. Ow. Hyperfang. <laughs> when in doubt, hyperfang it to death. Okay, so what's the blue squares on this on this map? I don't know. I don't understand what your blue squares are, friend. You've put oh this site can't be reached. Fantastic. So I can get the oh there it is. What is a blue square? Enter use a repel immediately after me after you enter but before moving. Nope. Uh, oh, it's a trainer battle. Oh, got it. Yellow squares are where you need to use repel. Red squares are the bike path. I can just ride my bike in here. What am I doing? Uh, no, I'll stick with Radcade. It's fine. Oh, there's two floors. There's multiple floors. Shit. This is slightly harder than I thought it was going to be. Did I get any repels earlier? No, of course I didn't because I'm not a queer like that. Let's get Hyperfang again. <laughs> disable, don't disable Hyperfang. That's fine. Oh no, Ragate's tackle is disabled. <laughs> no more baby rat rat for you. <laughs> they sell pills for that, it's fine. I got so much money for mugging that dude. Right, do I have my bike on me? I am bicycle. Right, down, then right. Ow. Oh, Zubats, no! I hate Zubats. <laughs> I'm starting to think I should have packed some repels. Run? Yeah, lovely. <laughs> this is so dumb. <laughs> right, where is one? There it is. So I go this way, and then this way. There's a trainer battle. <laughs> I can't believe this is working. <laughs> Pokemania wants to fight. Pokemania is now Slowpoke. Go Gyarados. Fuck it up. Thunderbolt. It's super effective. Oh, don't confuse him. He's easily confused. Oh, it didn't work anyway. Well, it didn't work that turn. So. Enemy Slowpoke fainted. Sorted. Right, so now I go this way, then up. 
Why are you giving me... That's far too many steps, man. Let's just let the trainers come to me. On this map, there's like... It's telling me to go next to the trainer and initiate the trainer battle myself. And I'm like, no. <laughs> that's not that's not what I'm here for, friend. I'm here to get through Rock Tunnel ASAP. We got appointments, okay? We got things to do. We got a lavender town to visit. That's what we got. I need to see my ghost boys. Um, this is not this is not gonna be good for you. Oh sleep out oh, don't send me to sleep. No! Do I have any awakenings? Nope. Curses. Alright, right, okay, you're up. Uh I pr I feel like I probably should have leveled up Spiro more than it currently is. Which is unfortunate. Because they're level 16, I think, and other trainers' Pokemon are level 22, and wild Pokemon are about uh, level 17-ish at the minute, so I'm getting the... Oh, you have a Bulbasaur! No, nope, I won't change. How cute! Bye! Dong! Sorry about that. That's me having my drink on the wrong side, because for some ungodly reason I still have my work laptop on my desk. Bulbs off there. Yeah, cool. I mean, I wasn't paying too much attention to that, I'll be honest. Oh, I lost. Here's some cash. Bye. Dun, 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 dun. There we go this way. Yeah, good. <laughs> oh, maybe these are the training battles we can't avoid. Ooh, match up. Uh, oh, God. Run. Just run. Uh, let me just... No, we're not Pokemon. Pokemon. Can I change the order of this? Of course I can't. Um, if I can change the order of Pokemon, level 16, switch you out. If we get into random battles now. <laughs> right, so I've just got down a ladder. No, I just need to, I just need to triangulate where I am. Okay, so now I need to be Good there. <laughs> Look at this room. I'm literally using speedrun straps to do this. <gasps> an onyx. <gasps> I might catch an onyx. Uh, good. Well, you are actually higher level than it. I mean, you're probably not as strong as it, but it's higher. That's not very effective. Um, I think is ground again. What's the? What's the the? God, words. What is the weakness of ground Pokemon and air Pokemon? Is Am I fighting one that I'm weak against? Oh, man. Language is hard right now. <laughs> My brain's in like six different places. You use Screech. It's fine. My defense greatly fell. I don't mind. <laughs> I'm okay with that. You use Screech, but it failed because my defense is probably zero at this point. Peck it. It's not very effective. You use Screech. Do you only know Screech? Uh, item. Let's use a Pokeball. Let's not forget. Oh, press your press your A buttons. Oh, damn it. Hold your A's. Oh. Just got minced. <laughs> Peck. It's not very effective. Screech. Peck. It's not very effective. Screech. Hopefully. Tackle no Spearow no uh, use next Pokemon next now serving number hot boy Fight uh, don't fight actually just throw a Pokeball at it Damn it Do it again Damn it One more time one more time for luck come on No, this isn't working. All right. Well, time to die. 
Oh, wow, your defense is really high, isn't it? <laughs> Screech! Oh no, now I have to remember where I am. Oh no, uh... Good, I'm against that wall. Fantastic. Excellent. Now you go in here. Lovely. Now I am... <laughs> This is so bonkers. Watch up. Nope. Bye. <laughs> See you later. Ta ra. Oh. Oh. I walked into a wall, Zubat. I didn't actually walk uh, walk a space then. I just tapped a wall. <laughs> nope. See you later. Uh, then this way, then this way, then this way. Then the train of battle, that's fine. Ha ha! Can you beat my power? How can you see me? <laughs> Isn't it weird that without Flash, I'm the only person... Like, everyone else... I'm the only person that would have Flash in this tunnel. Everyone else is literally walking around in the dark. <laughs> Water gun. Nail it. Pow. Done. Super effective. Excellent. Ratka, ra Ratka, Ratka is trying to learn focus energy. I don't like focus energy. Nope. Think so. Yep. Abandon focus energy. Ta. Bye. Uh, Geodude. No, I will stick with Ratka because Ratka knows water gun. And water gun is serving me well. Serving me well. I love you, know. It's serving me well. It's super effective. Hacker is about to use Gravla. That's what I like all at the end. Uh, no, I won't. Hacker sent out Gravla. Quick, Raticate used Water Gun. Oh, it's super effective. Gravla used Self Destruct. I mean, fair. I only had that one hit boy left. But you'd made that decision before that round. <laughs> Oops, something. I, don't, I didn't read. I, I don't read that. Uh, superb potion. Made in Kanzo. Um, I think I might have gotten a dud there. That'll do. Uh, where am I? I'm there. Yeah. Oh, this is a super. I'm going to lose it. Oh, it's Geo. I mean, that's sort of fine. Do. This is one of the um, side effects, I suppose. Side effects of not having the internet when I played this originally is that it never, ever crossed my mind to be able to do this without Flash. Ever. That's a train I just ran into, by the way. <laughs> just slam into them. Cool. That's you. Excellent. I came this far for Pokemon. Now I'm blind. Blind, I tell you. Junior trainer wants to fight. Junior trainer's out. Meowth. It's so cute. It's so cute. I don't want to kill it. You did it without Flash's kid. You fucking hipster. <laughs> I love your pieces, but you fucking hipster. <laughs> I did it before it was cool. But it did take you four hours. I can understand why it would take you four hours. I would 100%, without mapping it, I would 100% get lost. And I was not. I did it before it was cool. I, I did not have the patience to map shit when I was younger. Like, at all. Which is weird, considering I love video game maps now. I'm like a cartography nerd. But now I'm like, then I was like, nope. Don't have the attention span for that. Wait, did I actually map something out once? I remember using graph paper for something. I can't remember what it was, but it was something gamerly. I must have done it. it may, maybe it was like, um, oh, it was Hero Quest. I was playing a board game with my uncle. And that was it. No strategy, just mindless wandering. I'm surprised it didn't take you eight hours if you're just mindlessly wandering. You have to go through two floors and four separate compartments. There's like eight sections you can get lost in. In the dark. Whoa. 
Like, if I was going there and I knew, like, uh, where well, if I'm going to the top right, that's where the ladder I've just come down from is. That's about as much as I'd know. But finding the exact square, oh, jeez. That's ballsy, that is. Give us your money. Oh, fuck off. <laughs> Jesus, just boot it and run. Quick. We don't have time for this. <laughs> Go. <laughs> hey, we made it. <laughs> I'm feeling a bit faint from this tough hike. Oh, you're a trainer. Oh, fuck, fuck off. <laughs> I didn't realize you were a trainer. I thought you were just a random NPC. God damn it. That was the easiest challenge of my life. I don't know what speedrunners are worried about. This is... I'll, uh, I'll update the website and the commands to say speedrunning consultant, Pokemon Rock Tunnel speedrunning consultant. Right, okay, group level 28. Nice. That's where the big, that's where the big money is. <laughs> that's where the big money is. Gaming. That's where it is. Uh, no. Um, Hyperfang it, I guess. I mean, it's served as well so far. Yep, that'll do it. She had to break your spirit when you survived the cave with two HP in your last Pokemon. Yeah, and then you get zoomed straight back to the Pokemon Center. And you're just like, I hate this trainer. I'm not up to it. Right, now which way do I go? Point me in the way. That's Rock Tunnel. Yep, got that. Oh, it's a suspicious tree. Hey, I found a Magneto. Yeah, that, that trainer is known as the kick in the nuts. You're going to be... Oh, you're all going to be fucking trainers, aren't you? Is this a... <gasps> it's Lavender Town. Are we ready? Are we ready for this? Oh, I'm on my bike. That's why I can't hear the music. I'm like, did they change the music? Such a good tune. Absolute jam. <laughs> right, heal, heal these, please. These are very sick. <laughs> None of your voodoo jiggery pokery. I want them healthy. I'm not going to be... ...jebated. That's what that means. Uh, right. Let's leave. Let's listen to some music again. Lavender Volunteer Pokemon House. This is such a cursed village. I love it. This is my favourite place in Kanto. The Noble Purple Town. Agatha? Is that her name? I can't remember. Agatha? Cynthia? The gym leader? Also, where is the gym? I can't remember where the gym is. This is the tower. This is the mart. This is another route. That's fine. Oh, wait. She's in the tower, isn't she? Right, let's talk to people. Ghosts appear in Pokemon Tower. I think they're the spirits of Pokemon that the rockets killed. Fucking harsh. This town is known as a grave site for Pokemon. Memorial services are held in Pokemon Tower. Do you believe in ghosts? Yes. Really? So there are believers. Cut to one year from now when that child is selling uh, ghost repelling amulets on the side of the road. Uh, I'm searching for items to raise the abilities of Pokemon during a single battle. X Tech, X Defend, and X Speed, and X Special are what I'm after. Do you know where I can get them? <laughs> my, my guy just walks off. That, guy, that dude's probably just like, well, do you? Do you? Hi there, may I help? Hmm. Mm -hmm -hmm. No, I think I'm good. I mean, I might have some more superb potions. Maybe get them. Uh, I think that's probably enough. That's all the money I want to spend, I should say. I've become so frugal with money in games these days. I used to just be like, no, I'd rather be poor and well-equipped. 
than rich and dead. Hello, hello, I am the official name rater. You want me to rate the nicknames of your Pokemon? Yeah, sure, why not? Which Pokemon should I look at? Hot boy. Hot boy, is it? Oh, that's a decent nickname. Thanks, fix it myself. But would you like to give me would you like me to give it a nicer name? How about it? Yes. Fine, what should it name be? What should its name be? Sha wait, if I just end it now, will it go back to normal? Fine, come any time you like. Oh no, that's not. Uh, yes, I want you to rate the name of Hotboy. I still don't, for the life of me, I still don't remember why I nicknamed him. Charmelon. <laughs> I thought he was like Char Lemon or something like that. Charmelon. How about it? Yeah, sure, why not? I'm in my own little brain space there. Um, a. Oh. Me flare on own Wow. Okay, this Pokemon has been renamed Chameleon. That's a better name than before. Now I just need to remember to come back when it turns into a Charizard in like twenty levels. Because otherwise I'll be like, why have I oh, why have I got a level 50 Charmeleon? I hate those horrible rockets. The poor Cubones, that poor Cubone's mother, it was killed trying to escape from Team Rocket. And yet it's still wearing the skull of its mother on its head. Because that's the law, folks. Sorry, that's as in L-O-R-E. L-O-R-E. <laughs> Ooh, this is a different... Sorry, I forgot how good this tune was. Um, what is the other? Was is it just a sepia? Yeah, it's just gone red. What happens if I go outside with this tone off? It just looks sad. It looks like autumn. We've got an autumn filter just randomly assigned to the X button for some reason. I came to pray for my Clefairy. I can't stop crying. Bless. Did you come to pay respects? Bless you. Nope, I came to win badges. My Growlithe, why did you die? I hated the concept when I was younger of Pokemon Mortality. Like, that really shook me. And, like, this one place was, like, the epicenter for it. Hello. Pokemon Tower was erected in memory of Pokemon that had died. It's lovely. I am a channeler. These, there are spirits up to mischief. Okay, cool. Ugh. I'm gonna have to honor. No, mate. No one. Hey, Mike, what brings you here? Your Pokemon don't look dead. I can at least make them faint. Let's go, pal. Fuck this guy. No one wants to fight. No one is interested. Pidgeot or? I'll oh, piss. I did a wrong one, didn't I? Um, let's go. Uh, wait, hang on. What knows what? What knows what? That's uh, Gyarados. Level 23, though, and there's level 25. But I'm hoping, even if you use Gus, it's not going to be super effective. <sighs> Excuse me. It's been a week. Oh, boy. Bzzz. Dead. Yes. Gyarados learned, learned, learned to level 25, 24, even. Wow. I should just stop talking. <laughs> No one is about to use Growlithe. I will not change Pokemon. Oh, I should change Pokemon. I don't know any more moves. Fuck. Right. Let's change Pokemon. <laughs> to Raggy. Growlithe is raw. Raggy is unaffected. Raggy is well hard. That's why. <laughs> Raggy is hard as nails, mate. He's not being super effective. It didn't look it. Um, he's not being intimidated by Growler. Rack A is for the streets, man. He's the street version of Growler, let me tell you. He's the street version of Bulbasaur at this point. Do, 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 do. 
No, I was about to use execute. Uh, execute is yes. I will change Pokemon. I will change to Charming Leon. Charming Leon. Go get him, Charming Leon. Oh, that was speaking of Charming. Hello, Hugo. <laughs> Sorry, I'm enamored with my cat. Uh, Ember, burn it. That one massive egg in the background. An absolute thick boy in the back. Hit two times. Barrage is a real hit and miss move, isn't it? Like, I mean, I'm aware that that was almost a pun, but I wasn't meant as a pun. <laughs> Jamelian has gained some muscle points. Another Kadabra. Uh, yeah. I'll change Pokemon. Let's change to Spearow, because I don't think this Kadabra yet has any offensive moves. And if it does, well, then Spearow's fucked, isn't it? Uh, Fury Attack. Kadabra used Teleport, but it failed. Fury Attack. Wabam. 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 Hit the enemy three times. Fury Attack again. Disable, but it failed. Oh, I, I failed as well. It's disable, but it failed. Wabam. 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 Hit it three times. Come on, another one. Confusion. That is an offensive attack. It's a, blood it's a good one. I'll give him that. It's a good one. Bye, Spiro. Uh, right, Radicate. Saw it out. And now I imagine Radicate with like a pocket knife or something. Peaky blind as cat. That's, that's the sort of character I expect from Radicate right now. Let's use Wartortal. Wartortal. Uh, yes, I will. I'm going to switch to Gyarados because Gyarados knows it. Kick ass Thunder Move. He going to fuck you up. Gyarados going to fuck you up, boy. Ooh, boy. Gyarados going to ruin your day. Wartortal use Bite. I can do that. Look. Ow. Bite, chew, rip, and rend. I defeated no one. What you'll be remembered as. No one. What? You stinker. I took it easy on you too. <laughs> you didn't seem to. Now give me your fucking money. <laughs> How's your Pokedex coming along? I just caught a Cubone. I can't find a grown up Marowak yet. I doubt there are any left. Well, I better get going. I've got a lot to accomplish, pal. Smell you later. You just like. We could just kick him down the stairs. Like, I don't think anyone would know. I don't think anyone would rat us out. I mean, just one quick boot. Just take out a knee. Now, I think the channelers challenge me at this point. Even we could not identify the wayward ghosts. A sylph scope might be able to unmask the... Oh, I've got to get a scope, haven't I? I forgot. Because thingy's possessed. Right. Be gone, evil spirit. This is where the the super ghost sprite comes from. The cursed ghost sprite. And now ghastly. Ghastly. I do like ghastly. I like Gengar more though. Gengar's probably one of my favourites. No, I can't remember if physical moves are completely... Yeah, I think I might be in a bit of trouble there. Because I don't have any non-physical moves. Right, okay, he's confused. That's understandable. You hate some confusion. I mean, thunder would probably be a decent shout. Uh, confused no more. Use water gun. Okay. Oh, God. Nightshade. That's not as good as I remember that being. Uh, water gun again, I guess. It's not the greatest move in the world. Use the lick. I forgot to get the lick. I love how Gen 1 Ghastly really has no shade. It really doesn't, yeah. It's just mist. Um, I'm going to give you a superb potion. And that'll make you feel better. A confused rain. You're being confused. I forget how menacing Gaston's face actually is. Like, he was proper angry. And big, big fangs as well. He's like the ghost of Thingy. Um, the Count. 
really missed the mark with art with later art. See, uh, see, I see, I see what you did there, Bruce. I approve. That gets a lovely rubber stamp of approval from me. Whew, the spirit left. I got money. Hello. My friends were possessed too. Where do we get self scope from? I can't remember. Do I need to get it from another place, or do I get it from here? Uh, God, stop, stop throwing my mouse around. I have a real problem with this mouse. I just I, my hand keeps catching it all the time. Self scope. Da -ba -da -ba -da. Celadon City. Oh, I see. Yeah, I love, I love that you're giving me all of this lore. I just want to know where to get it. Where do you get it? First period in the... What? No, that's the manga. <laughs> Don't give me that. Jesus. Um... It, it does not, it does not tell me anywhere. This is bull. Bulba Garden is cack for it. Right, Celadon City. Cool. I don't. I can't remember where Celadon City is now. Where is Celadon City? Celadon City. Okay, it's three root eight. Sweet, so we'll do this bit, and then we need to go to Game Corner. Uh, we need to go to Game Corner in Celadon City. Channel R. Do do do. Uh, I oh no, okay. <laughs> I have a feeling my Eradicate's not in a good space right now. Did I find miss, or did it not affect it? Damn, doesn't affect it. Genesis. Quick attack. No, because it's a physical move. Numbnuts. Tackle is also a physical, so also normal moves don't work. Got it. Oh, good. I'm confused. Well, I used walk on, so there's, there's that. Confuse Ray, but it failed. I saw a brilliant. Because um, I'm obviously playing Pokemon and I'm searching for Pokemon stuff, I'm getting Pokemon Gen 1 related uh, memes on the internet now. And the one I got today was um, my only uh, strategy to play Pokemon is to be like 20 levels higher than the gym leader. That's it. And then someone responded with oh, everything. When you have the biggest hammer in the world, everything is a nail. And I'm like, yeah, that's, that, that, feels, that feels pretty apt. I know that won't have any effect. I didn't want to use it on Spiro. Spiro's dead. That's the way I always used to play it. I want to be, I want to be much higher. I want to be high enough level past my enemies that I don't need to worry about any of the sort of um, weaknesses or strengths or anything like that. You'd have a level 100 Geo dude just beating the piss out of a Blastoise. <laughs> oh come on, one HP, jeez. One HP cheese. Oh, don't you? You just injured yourself more than they did. Oh come on! This is not an underdog story, Gastly. And I hate to break it to you, this is not an underdog story, right? The enemy's weak. Get him, Gyarados. Uh, let's use Thunderbolt. Buzzed. Hmm, what am I doing? You got money. Sorry, I was possessed. Possessed or processed does that? Possessed, okay. Oh. Bums. Oh yeah, of course, ghost, because I can't, yeah. But ghost can't be ID'd. And I can't catch it. And I can't hurt it, and it will just hurt me. Uh, so I gotta run away. <laughs> Ooh. 
It's the cursed Pokemon from Pokemon Black. That episode is available in Smith's Myths uh, playlist on my YouTube channel. Find all of it using the exclamation mark socials command. Um, yeah, let's leave that. Let's leave that one alone. It's got trainers to kill. Hello. I'm imagining like phasmo related noises. Oh, I don't play phasmo in a while. I don't play phasmo since Halloween. Um, can we do... Why did Paris come out first? Oh, because Racket fainted. Got it. Stun spot. That's a grass move, at least. I wonder if Dig would work. Yeah, I paralyzed the ghost. I'm not sure how that worked. Paris dug a hole. Ghastly used Nightshade. Ghastly missed. Wow, wow. that was really effective. Hey, Pokemon's 999, how you doing? Hope you're doing well, Brian. It's super effective. Ghastly it. Wow. Go Paris. Jeez. Who knew who knew ground attacks with that dig attack was good against ghosts? Well you gotta save yourself. The ghosts can be identified by the self scope. What's this? An escape rop. Why would I need an escape rop? Uh oh. Yet another unidentifiable ghost Pokemon. Edge crashed. Darn, the ghost can't be ID'd. Cool, let's leave it be. Leave it be. Leave it be. You know what the, the definition of madness, Mike. You know what the outcome will be if you try and attack it. Um, Super potion. on. I mean, on Paris now, because Paris is an absolute beast against these. You don't go his power against that. Oh, fuck, I hope not. Just quick, quick safety save. Do you know, I'm having to do that on a game I'm playing at the moment. I'm playing Bear and Breakfast on Switch. And it is a really good game, but for the fact that it has bugs, and when you find one of those bugs, it breaks the game. Like, it breaks, breaks the game. Um, and sometimes it can just, I assume, have some sort of like RAM overflow issue because when you go from one section to another, it will just downright just go, nope, we've exited because there's a problem. And there's no autosave feature, which I think is criminal. In this day and age, I, I genuinely think no autosave is criminal, um, especially for a laid back game because all you're doing there is just layering on pressure. Then, if I played for six hours and it crashes, the something that's not my fault just because it wants to then i'm like well what's my motivation to go on a plane like i'm gonna have to leave this alone for a few days before i do that but no hopefully fingers crossed it was so weird as well like all of the area went out uh, it's not the first time it's happened either we used to live in this area um and it happened a couple of times when we lived here last only weirdly when it happened last time all of the neighborhood car alarms went off at the same time so we assumed it was some sort of like emp blast because why would it not be we're currently playing divinity original sin 2 right now amongst other things so i'm constantly spamming the quick save button yeah quick save is is absolutely a must have in games these days like i don't mind a quick save feature that is just like oh um you need to go back half an hour that's unfortunate do you know what i mean that's on me but a game like this i save this at the start of the stream and at the end of the stream so i'm like shit i do that normally it happened um i was playing stardew valley because for some reason i never turn my consoles off because fuck the planet right um but i had my ps5 on uh rest mode so it, it had stardew valley open on quick resume because i'm well spoiled by quick resume as well like first world problems i'm well spoiled by quick resume um we can't crack the identity of the ghosts i would guess i would guess ghosts um dead pokemon is probably my guess uh so i was playing stardew valley on the ps5 and I'd done like two days worth of stuff, including getting one of the star drops um, from the Stardew Valley Festival, which was not an easy feat. So I'd done that, I'd done a mining day and I'd done a fishing day or something like that. And then the power out happened 
So I like a couple of days passed, and then I went back to it, and I'm like, oh yeah, of course, because I've got I'm playing Stardew Valley. I loaded it up, and it's like, yeah, the Stardew Valley Festival is today. It's being set up in the town centre. I'm like, <sighs> I quit. <laughs> I'm not doing that again. Needless to say, I didn't go back to the um, Stardew Valley Festival and get the star drop. I think I infuriate people with the way I play um, Stardew Valley because I, uh, I, I'm super, I'm pretty super chill about it, what I do and how I do it. Like I know a lot of people, I've watched uh, some people play Stardew and they they try and min max the entire first year and respect to them absolute respect to them they can do it uh, but it's, that's just not that's just not me i'm just like i just want to make a nice fence and a nice path do you know what i mean <laughs> my biggest problem is the fact that with games like that unless it is i say forced upon me unless it is forced upon me my oh i used it cool um my biggest problem and it was with the harvest valley harvest harvest valley harvest moon games god my brain today um the harvest moon games is the social sa social aspect of it i can't get my head around the social i don't care enough about some of these characters to go and give them a gift every day do you know what i mean but i think i'm getting a little bit better at that oh look a ghost darn the ghost can't be id'd Go pass. Run away. Thanks. So now we're going to go through here as much as we can. Something is being guarded by... Wait, does Lavender Town have a gym? I can't remember. Where is where is Agatha? Is she... Oh, wait, no. Is she one of the Elite Four? Am I being dumb? I think I'm being dumb. Ooh. HP up. Lovely. I swear to God, I saw a sprite just glitch out there for a second. Uh, not too much of an Xbox fanboy, but Quick Resume is a game changer on that. I stopped playing Red Dead Redemption for like six months and left it on Quick Resume. I've been on vacation and then through a power outage, etc. Went to play it again and Arthur was right where I left him and got straight back into the game. Yeah, I'm very, very spoiled with Quick Resume. Uh, to the point where I will wonder um why i still have games on my quick resume that i've either finished or i haven't played in like almost six months basically and i'm just like yeah i, I if, I'm, I'm past the point of playing that now <laughs> but yeah quick resume big big fan of that uh diggy diggy hole of course you'd be getting confused You hurt yourself in the confusion. Care says. Do it again. As in, don't do that again, obviously. Oh, God. God damn it, Paris. Uh, okay. Charmeleon, I guess. I mean, we have a, a number of uh, non-normal moves. We have one. We have that, that's a number. One's a number, right? <laughs> it's like me. I'm in shape. Rounds are shape. It's fine. Um, hurt by the burn. <laughs> One HP. <laughs> oh, that's not nearly as effective as big. <laughs> Curses. Right, how do... Where is Solo City? We have to go through Lavender Town, through Route 8. And then through, like, the central bit. Like, the... The weird... Um... Oh, what's it called? Like, the gatehouse. In order to get it... In order to get to Silent Hill City, so we can get to the game call and we can get. Oh, good! I wasn't paying attention. My Charmeleon is nearly dead. <laughs> really should be paying attention. Where is the ghost? I got money. Uh, how do you pause now? Superb potion. Made in Ganto. Yep. I'm probably going to give one to Gyarados. He's looking a little. A little sore. So. Um, I think I checked this way earlier. It's a ghost. No. Just automatically give me the option to leave. I can't not see um, the Pokemon Black Edition when I see that ghost. The Cursed Black Edition. 
I, honestly, just the old man in Lavender Town, sort of dotting around, and it just plucking sprites out of the game and just being like, "Oh, you um, you want to fight this trainer? Well, you've defeated this trainer, and now you've attacked this trainer, and now this trainer's dead." What happened to Hot Boy? Or was it a different Pokemon game? No, no, it's this Pokemon game. I've just renamed it. Um, like I said, I don't really know why I named him Hot Boy. I never normally give nicknames. You shall join that one of us. One of us. Do I work with someone who'd never heard that saying before? The one of us saying. Never heard it before in their life. I was like, and they're not young either. Um, yeah, no, I changed it. Uh, you can change them in Lavender Town. Um, because, yeah, I never normally... Uh, hey, Katniss, how you doing? It's good to see you. Um, I never normally we nickname our Pokemon. Um, I normally have them just as that Chinese for powers. Fuck. Right, let's just switch you out for Gerardo. This is not going as I planned, but I do know that that thing on the floor to the south of me right now, I think is a Huey spot. So, I just need to get through this one. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't nickname my Pokemon very often, and I, I think, I think because whenever I see people streaming Pokemon, there was a, a moment of weakness there where I'm like, well, they've got to have funny names, otherwise it's not entertaining, right? So I think there was a moment there where I was like, well, I'll just name him Hot Boy, um, because that was what came to my head, and I immediately regret it. <laughs> right, you, oh, fuck, there's another one. Not you, you're not the, no, you're the, you're just a ghost that I can ignore. I'm happy with that. Drop it, run. Run, like it. It's gonna be, it's gonna be me. Uh, switch. Superb potion. There. There. It's also a problem because you, then you can't recognize the greatest. Yeah, absolutely. There was also a weird thing when I was growing up. Um, so me and a friend... I, oh, wait. Are you not a... Oh. Fuck. How do you recognize Pikachu if they're called Alfred? Also, you then... If you're battling people, you're then... Your trainer's like, go, Alfred, and Pikachu comes out. Like, I just don't... I never got it. I never... No, 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 no. I'm, I'm muscle memorying. <laughs> you're not a trainer, are you? Come, child, I've sealed this space with white magic. You can rest here. Thanks. Entered purified protected zone. Mike's Pokemon are fully healed. Lovely. Uh, oh, God. Are you going to attack me the second I click off the screen? I need to switch you for you. Uh, wait, what does Raike have? No, Paris, sorry. Switch you for you, because Paris is apparently the the absolute legend when it comes to this. There we go. Zombies! Zombies ate my Pokemon trainer. No! Channel R wants to fight. At least they've all only got one Pokemon, which is good, I suppose. Dig. Dig. Don't use Nightshade. Don't get confused. Don't use Nightshade. Don't get confused. Mm, yes. You was like, but you missed because you licked a hole in the ground, you nutter. <laughs> Ghastly, you fainted. Oh, I need a new pair of headphones. Pinch my head. The one Pokemon that is hunting them. <laughs> haunting them, sorry. Yeah. The one that has taken over their bodies. I regained my senses. Um, I'm going to get this first. Oh, I found a nugget, you utter nugget. You sound like the captain earlier. Channel there, what's that? Is it Ghastly? Oh, it's a haunter! Look at his face. He's so handsome. Uh, I feel like I should heal you, but um, oh, I'm just going to try and dig. Can you eat the nugget? I mean, you could if you don't like your teeth. Dug a hole. Good. Lick. Lick a hole. <laughs> well, bam! I can't get over how good Dig is against these ghost Pokemon. That's really good. 
Just I love that when you level up, when there's battle music and the low health and not alarm and you level up, it just fucks up the music completely. <gasps> Paris is evolving. I dropped my controller in, in surprise then. That's what I'm talking about. That is what I'm talking about. Uh, I still need to heal it. It doesn't magically heal, I don't think. No, it was before the days when it magically healed when you leveled up, when you dinged. Why would my teeth suffer for it? I eat it now, not chew it to powder. I said eat it, not chew it to powder. I mean, yeah, fair enough, yeah. Instructions unclear, lost all my teeth. Um, oh, ghosts. There's always ghosts. Go, Parasect. You look ridiculous from this side, Parasect. <laughs> Just let you know. Oh, come on. <laughs> what is this? Phasmo? Jeez. Ghost can't be ID'd. I should have packed some repels. But weirdly, that Pokemon didn't sell any. Lost one teeth. Where did you see them last? Uh, in a nugget. <laughs> Give me blood. You, you've got my teeth. I'm pretty certain I saw, last saw my teeth in your hands. Oh, you have three Pokemon. Well, I will shut my face. Go Parasect. And they're all level, going to be level 22, aren't they? Dig. No, not lick. Dig. Parasect is paralyzed. It may not attack. Are you fully paralyzed? No. Ghastly, you confused it, but missed. And I'm fully paralyzed. Fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> I'm now paralyzed underground. I dug a hole. Excellent. Parasite used dig. What bam? That Pokemon is horrible, just ghastly. Get out. <laughs> uh, what are you about to use now? Another ghastly? No, I'll stick with you. <laughs> That's it, Camus. Make like a tree and leave. Oh, dig. <laughs> I've been doing so much work in the evenings recently on what's coming up for this channel in the new year, and I'm so excited to share it. <laughs> I am so excited to share it. quick um, preview of it is it's basically going to become a hot tub stream channel. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> if it's OnlyFans content, don't show it on Twitch. <laughs> I, I, no, I couldn't do it on OnlyFans. <laughs> I haven't got the, I haven't got anything, the anything for an OnlyFans. <laughs> A parasite dug a hole. Good, you missed. Excellent. You missed again. And now I'm fully paralyzed underground from post -like. Fuck. Used Confuse Ray, but it failed. You used Dig, but it didn't fail. And now you're double dead. Dead, dead. <laughs> I defeated the channeler. Groan. You sound like such a fucking millennial. <laughs> Groan. Lol. Uh, I feel anemic and weak. Do you know if you feel anemic? Like, I've never, f I don't think I've ever felt weak and thought, oh, I feel anemic. Do you know what I mean? Fully paralyzed underground. Isn't that just being dead and buried? Yeah, that's, that's the definition of being dead, surely. <laughs> oh, I saw a, um, a good horror game that I might play at some point called, I think it was called Buried. Um, and it basically, first person, you are buried alive and you have to escape. It's basically like an escape room, but you're in a coffin. And I'm like, cool, that's one of my biggest fears. Fantastic. I don't know how I feel about this. Um, but the first time I watched play it was having so many technical issues. I don't know what was going on. It's a, it's a demo of a game. It's like a, an indie game, right? And they were having so many tech issues. I don't know if it was just poorly optimized or their rig or the game but they're constantly having problems with it 
Kiki. <laughs> no, that's just that's just you. That's just how you talk. What's going on here? Kiki, 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 Kiki. Um, I don't think you can feel the anemic per se. Only consequences of it being tired and weak due to lack of oxygen. But those things can have other causes. Yeah, exactly. Like there have been times when I've thought that, and I'm like, well, I'm clearly hungry. Or, you know, I've, I've not eaten enough protein today. Because that's a thing. That's a, I didn't realise that until I started weightlifting. If I don't eat enough food to run my body, I start to feel faint. Um, dig it. Get, oh no, it's a goat! No! It's a ghost! I completely fluffed that, didn't I? Oof. Qua! What, you a chocobo? Channel always fight. Is it a ghastly? It's ghastly. It's ghastly. He's so handsome. Oh, I've just seen because uh, I've got the the Canto map up on there uh, on this monitor to my right. Don't be ch don't say Chuck was a qua, not qua. Sorry. Yes. <laughs> of course. My apologies. <laughs> I should know this, being a fan of Fantasy Seven, fucking fanboy. <laughs> Final Fantasy VII will always have a huge place in my heart. The original and the remake. The remake because it's f amazing, but the original specifically because it was the game that I was playing first time through um, when my mum passed away, uh, which is cool. Which is fine. I I can talk about it now. Um, thanks therapy. Uh, but it was um, yeah, it was a while before I went back to gaming, obviously. Uh, but it became a bit of an escape for me and uh, being able to because I played like the first disc or two over and over and over again and then I just never played the next ones I don't know why either maybe I just got under leveled or something um, but I yeah it was one of those games that I thought uh, oh reckon me um, the story was really poignant to me like there's a lot of bits and pieces in that story that I'm just like I obviously associate it with key core memories because something tragic happened during that time in my life but I also remember how I felt when I played through it first so I absolutely love that game you thought Final Fantasy 9 was better oh be gone intruders oh no are you the ghost Marowak you are aren't you you thought Final Fantasy 9 was better but 8 is, eight, uh, but 7 is iconic right so I have so I don't I don't maybe I didn't didn't really get nine I enjoyed seven and I thought eight I'm just gonna use this gift oh no that's the sepia um tone the sepia uh, uh filter can I use an escape rope here I could just use dig couldn't I that was dumb um What was I about to say? Uh, yeah, so I enjoyed Final Fantasy VII. Really, really loved. Absolutely iconic, like we've said. Um, a lot deeper than than I thought it was going to be. Like, like uh, uh, the message that it had, its story, and also the gameplay as well. Um, eight, I thought was really good because it was the same but different and felt improved. Nine... I mustn't have played it at the right time, or I just didn't gel with it, but it felt like a step backwards to me. And I don't know, a lot of people say, oh, nine's, nine's fantastic, nine's brilliant. And I don't take anything away from that. I think I do think it was a good game, but I think I played seven to completion because it was seven, it was fantastic. And then I picked up eight, and then I could not put eight down because I felt compelled that I was like, I want to know what happens next. I want to know what happens next. And nine, I was just like four or five hours in, and I'm like, I don't, I don't really, I don't think I care that much about this, you know? And maybe that's just me. I'm not sure. Um, but maybe I need to, maybe I need to play it again. Who knows? Maybe I just played it at the wrong part of my life. You can like eight the most out of seven to nine. I mean, we can't argue that ten is also a fantastic game. Ten, I have strong feelings about ten as well because I played that when I was at college. Uh, one of the first people in my family to go to college as well. Um, eight, because I'm a smart ass. 
First time having characters of the appropriate size. Yeah, that was good. I mean, when... Wait, eight. Yeah, eight. Um, I love the, the... It felt really epic. You know the garden battle bit? Like, when they're going going at each other? Brilliant. It's just as cinematic as you needed it to be. Does that make sense? You should play nine again, but stream it. Maybe. One day. I love how whenever we talk about streaming folklorizing it now you always suggest games that are hundreds of hours long <laughs> like my dude i don't i don't have that much time i stream six hours a week <laughs> i'm gonna start a final fantasy 9 playthrough and i'm gonna be finished in 2026 <laughs> if i speed run it as well <laughs> not like if i just play it casually I was checking, um, it's weird, weird peek behind the curtain here, but I was looking at how long to beat um, certain games a while ago. And um, I categorized games into like uh, indie game. So I could play multiple indie games in a stream because they're less than an hour long. Uh, short game, less than three hours. Long game, uh, three between three hours and nine hours, I think. So that's like three streams, right? Or four streams if I dawdle and talk like this and get lost and die, that sort of thing. Um, and then there were ones that were like probably never going to complete. And there were things like Cozy Grove that's like 150 hours. Like I personally have played Cozy Grove for a year and a half. And I'm, I'm now at the end. <laughs> but that's that's considered to be a game that's specifically designed to play for two hours at a time. And I'm like, perfect. Absolutely perfect. It, which is weird as well, because it, it's right on my street. It's about death, and it's a cosy game. So I'm like, ooh, that's, ooh, that's just the sweet spot. That is, it's one of those games that really hits the spot. But yeah, there, there was a lot of games. I did notice that a lot of games that Folk Horizon 899 had mentioned were on the list of probably never going to finish on stream. That's because I either don't I don't have time to play them either. So it's easy for me to watch you play them. That's fair. <laughs> you still love the dollop bit near the beginning. That you yes! Yes! There's reused several parts of the game, but that dollop part is still yeah, still karma with the heartbeat, yeah. With the reuses like the garland, uh, the, the the battle, the garden battle, sorry. See, it's just starting to lay apart, yeah. Ah, oh, such good music. Uh, dig? I'm not paying attention because we're talking about Final Fantasy. Sorry. <laughs> oh, good, my attack fell. Lovely. Uh, just, shall we just use cut now? That'll be, uh, yeah, good. Go Final Fantasy was pretty solid too, as was 10 2. Hated 15 though, the world felt boring and empty. Which one was the one with the judges? Uh, the judges was my last one that I played, um, and that felt alright, but pretty. T that was 12. That was the one, last one I played. Oh no, wait! 15. 15 was the one. Was that the one with. No Nocturd or whatever his name was? Final Fantasy 15. That was 15. Yes, I did play that. It didn't feel like a Final Fantasy game. It, yeah, the road trip one. Thank you, Catmus. Yeah, it didn't. It didn't feel like a Final Fantasy game in the slightest. And it felt like it re was really, really short. Like it felt like I don't know. Maybe I played it wrong. I don't know, but it felt really short. Noctus. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> uh, I liked the like cooking aspect of it, and I liked the. Um, the side quest aspect of it more than the actual main quest. The main quest was just like, well, this guy's a bit of a dick. I don't really like this Noctis guy. Like, sorry, I don't. I don't really. All these people are just, are just in like this is indentured servitude. <laughs> this is this is less friendship and more servitude. It feels, you know. But the song playing at the beginning when they're pushing the car like that, <laughs> yeah, cinematic, cinematic as well. Yeah, absolutely. Never played past 13, only 13 won. So it speaks, so to speak, didn't play any of the spin offs like 10 2, 13 2, or 13 3. Oh, wait, was that the lightning one? The lightning returns one? I've got that somewhere. Um, 
Yeah, I didn't. I, I didn't play that. Yeah, I didn't play that. I didn't like the idea. Was it that one? Was it 13 where they said, oh, it, it gets good after the first 20 hours? Like every review I read when it came out, they were like, oh, I did, you know, 15, 20 hours in, it really opens up. And I'm like, How, what? <laughs> That's like going to see Lord of the Rings and it only being good in the last half of the third movie. <laughs> the 13 trilogy gets so much better for the first one. <laughs> it starts pretty much corridor-like and after 30 or 40 hours you finish the tutorial. I was supposed to... Uh, here's an anecdote that's probably not on the list. The game's journalism anecdote. I was supposed to review um, Final Fantasy 13. And I started playing it, and I I got uh, to read. It was after the release, but I got I was part of the secondary push they call it. So you get the primary push, your secondary push, and your tertiary push, right? Um, your primary push are your your big your big places like Eurogamer, IGN, that sort of thing. Uh, your secondary push are your why am I just swapping Pokemon? I didn't even realize I was doing that. Um, your secondary push are your smaller sites but still have a bit of impact. Your tertiary push are bloggers, individuals, that sort of thing. I was working for a website at the time. So it's part of the secondary push. Um, and basically, I got to read all of the reviews for it when it came out. Uh, so I ended up giving it... I was an editor. I ended up giving it to one of our staff writers because I was like, I don't want to do this. <laughs> genuinely don't want to do this um, so I ended up giving it to a staff writer who lived uh, I can't remember where they lived now it was after Slim Gamer at the time um, but I was working freelance as an editor for another website and they were like oh you like Final Fantasy I'm like yeah I'm not going to like this though <laughs> you find yourself struggling to play JRPGs these days I find them to be too grindy for me now I can only assume it's because of the limited gaming time and I don't want to spend the grinding speed on the beach one mate. Yep. Hard agree. Hard agree. Um, there's elements of this that feel grindy as well. Like, I, I feel like some of this is... Oh, wait, this is not like a special Pokemon area. I'll come back to this. Um... Let's leave you a second. We're gonna re... We're gonna rerun through this bit. Oh, Jesus! <laughs> Fucking crowd of them. We must look silly standing here like this. You look ridiculous, friends. Um, yeah, hard agree. I don't. I'm not a big fan of grindy games unless it, the grind is specifically the game, the core game mechanic, like Diablo. Right. That's that's a core game mechanic. Is you know, press buttons, watch numbers go up. I like that. Um, oh, this is going to go well. What is it? Uh, but games that are just like, hey, in order to beat this enemy, you need to go and just do, beat the same enemies for the next 12 hours. I'm like, no, I don't. <laughs> oh, what was the name of the thing? The name of the hidden boss in Final Fantasy X? It took me fucking forever to find. Um, oh, there was a hidden. There was a hidden boss for ages. No one knew about it. And it was pre, well, early days of the internet, so not a lot of people really knew about it. Um, but you had to go and beat like six other sub bosses, which were hard, right? Um, and then this big sub boss, this big uh, secondary boss, appeared. Yes, that's it, the Dark Aeon ones. So you went and beat the Dark Aeons, because the summons were called Aeons, weren't they? You went and beat the Dark Aeons. And then something appeared in like the big central area. I can't remember its name. I remember it had a silly hat. That's all I really remember <laughs> when it appeared. And I remember never beating it because it was ridiculously overpowered. Uh, nope, I will not change Pokemon. You can use Nidoran all you want. It's probably going to kill me. Actually, I will use a superb potion. Yeah, there's a little bit of me that's like. I should probably level these up out of stream as well, but I never get a chance to um, for, for Pokemon. Because I never know... Uh, there's more than six... There's more than six, if I recall correctly, and you find me... Pen penance! That was it. Penance. Thank you. Yeah, Penance looked dumb, but was... Uh, 
that felt like a good achievement. I was obviously pretty achievements, but that felt like a good achievement to, to even unlock that. Do you know what I mean? Uh, nope, I will not change. Pens, wow. I miss days like that. I miss, I miss like almost um, this blind. What the hell happened then? Oh, I flinched, didn't I? That was it. Uh, this almost blind um, discovery of video game uh, secrets and lore. Like I said, early days of the internet. Um, not like early, early. I'm not that old, but early ish days of the internet. Uh, but I didn't have it at home, so it was a case of uh, my, me and two friends at college were playing Final Fantasy X at the same time. And then when we went, came to college, we would talk about what we were doing at that point in time. Um, and then, it was, so it was all the same up until the late game stuff. And then someone was like, "Oh, have you met? Oh, Anima. That was it. Was that was the one that was really, really horrible because uh, the Dark Aeon Anima." Um, had a move, I think, that just immediately poisoned you with like the worst type of poison. So you could only beat it if you had a ribbon on, and ribbons in Final Fantasy games make you immune to poison. But there was, I think, there was only one in the games, so or only one of your characters. Like you had to go on another quest to get this, so that one of your characters could survive to then resurrect the others. It was bonkers, but you didn't know what to do, like <laughs> unless you bought a a prima uh, guidebook which also didn't tell you what to do <laughs> how did they get away with writing guidebooks that were just basically they weren't even guidebooks some of the times they were just like here's what we think we know about this bit uh, you know <laughs> there's probably a secret here there's not you, you just think there was <laughs> the good old times absolutely you still got your guidebook for five and ten, fantastic. There's, there is part of me that misses those days, but then I'm just like, wow, I'm glad we don't. I'm glad that's not a thing anymore. Like, I'm super... So, what, what is this? Go, go away. Uh, wait, is this the kindergarten? Is that what this is? Underground path, Celadon City to Lavender Town. Okay, cool. I'll go in here. Um, it's looking a bit worse for wear now, but it's still around. The department store in Celadon has great... Oh, that's where the big shop is, isn't it? Right, let's let's bike it. Although I love that music. Yeah, I'd, uh, I got my Fable one to a hardback copy. Ooh, that's probably worth a bit now. Um, like, more than, like, 10p, basically. I heard a sleepy Pokemon appeared near Celadon City. Yep. Uh, now I don't remember where I'm going. God, Fable's a fucking good series as well. Uh, is it this way? Yes, it is this way. Oh wait, is this place overrun by rocket? Just, get, just heal me. Heal me. Heal me. It's, heal me and I'll save. I think that's what I used to do. I used to save every time I used to go to a Pokemon station. Pokemon station. Pokemon center. Your Pokemon are fighting fit. We hope to see you again soon. Cheers. The music brings back rocket memories. This music. Probably worth a pound, I'll sell it to you for a ton of them. Nah, I'm good, thanks. <laughs> I don't need that, I've got the internet. <laughs> uh, right, game. <laughs> Any tenor. <laughs> I can sing, I'm a tenor. <laughs> <laughs> Where is Game Center? Is this a gym? No? Trainer tips. X accuracy increases the accuracy. Get 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 off. That's an advert. Uh, that's the department store. That's good. I like that. Oh no, that's not the department store. That's the department store. Unless this is too? What is this? Oh, the Celadon Mansion. Of course it is. How would I know that? Uh, let's see if I can find the Game Center. Excuse me, come on through. Nope. I thought the game center was just a house somewhere. Jim, 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 Jim. How do I get down there? Oh, this way. <laughs> oh, hello. Why are you just over there a second ago? Oh, I blew it all on the slots. I knew I should have cashed in my coins for prizes. Oh, excuse me. 
Game tent? No, training tips. No, these are all just adverts for the thingy. Get your items at the cell and department store. Go get fucked. Oh, I don't know if these are also training tips. Rocket Game Corner, the playground for grown ups. That's it, that's what I want. Fun fact, most people that heard the three tenors only remember two of them, always Pavarotti, and then some only remember uh, Domingo, and others only remember Carreras, but rarely both. I only remember one. Legitimately only remember one. <laughs> they say, saw the three tenors, Pavarotti, Domingo, and the other one. I can't remember how to make this guy move. Oi. Oh god, this poster. Go away, or else. Oh, this is how I make it move. Excellent. Yeah. Well, I always used to say Pavarotti in the other two. <laughs> Three tenors, you know, Pavarotti and his mates. And obviously, my dad would always make the Three tenors, that's 30 quid. Joke. Because a tenor is ten pounds. God damn, that was good. Uh, cut. But it failed. I don't know what you did. Yeah, do you know, I... I, ju I just saw on this screen the Final Fantasy XV stuff. And I'm trying my hardest to remember any section of it. And I really can't. Like, I remember the game. Don't get me wrong. I remember driving around. I remember the world. I remember farming for stuff. I remember fighting things on a field. But story bits, no. Completely lost. Yeah, don't don't remember any of that. Uh, do you want to check my No. He was born Joseph. Joseph. Artistically called Jose. Oh, okay. I never knew that. You're a fountain of knowledge sometimes, countless. Now, I just use dig against something that flies. That's exactly what I thought was going to happen. Excellent. Body slam. <laughs> use supersonic, but it failed. That's fine. Yeah, at some point next week. Maybe next week. I'm not sure. We'll see how Monday goes. I'm going. Um, Oh, we're going out, out on Sunday. <laughs> Which is <laughs> it's never a good thing. Uh, now move. Oh, how am I going to be discovered? I better tell boss. Bye. See ya. Yeah, I'm going out, out on Sunday. Um, so I'm going to see how that... Where did he go? Oh, my God. Um, I'm going to see how hungover I am on Monday and see whether or not I stream. But at some point next week, um, I'm going to... I need to sort out some wires on this uh... no I don't want to push it again good um, I need to sort out this setup because everything feels proper janky at the minute it feels a little bit like as soon as I move something it's all going to fall apart you sure going out out on a Sunday is why is it yours I'm like it's not a Friday or a Saturday <laughs> I've got the Monday off don't worry <laughs> to a um, a light gun gaming bar so basically it's a bar but you can rent out kiosks where you can play light gun games but the guns are converted real guns so you've got like a, a Desert Eagle, a Beretta a submachine gun, an AK-47 that sort of thing but they're all retrofitted to be light guns rather than you know, obviously gun guns um, shooting on gun guns so you get to wield guns and drink booze and not hurt anyone. So that's good. And play light gun games on big screen TVs. <laughs> Which is it's exactly my sort of thing, to be honest with you. I've still not set up a light gun for House of the Dead remake. Um, the light gun, I, I was so, so certain I would never not use. I'd use it every single stream. I've never used it. 
Um, I mean, I've used it, used it, but I've not used it, like, on stream. Uh, I don't think... No, I haven't used it on stream. Dig a hole. Hyperfang miss, because you bit a hole. What about you? Oh, that's so gross. Cut it. Because originally, um, I wanted to have a uh, Raspberry Pi with lots of arcade light gun games on. And I wanted to use it like a, a home arcade, basically. Like Time Crisis and Point Blank and House of the Dead. That's the original House of the Dead. And that was that there are, the, you know, you can do a lot of things with it, but it never felt quite as stable as I wanted. I kind of got it working, but it never felt stable. Um, certainly not in stable enough that I would I would want to sort of like have it sat next to the TV downstairs and use it on a regular basis. I was just like, yeah, but I need to now have a keyboard and mouse downstairs and then do this thing and then that thing. And sometimes this works, sometimes it doesn't. And I'm like, I just can't, I can't be doing with that. I want it. I, I'm a, I'm a simple user of things. I want things to just work. I mean, that's, that is why I like Max, but uh, who are you? How did you get here? I just walked in, mate. I'm the new recruit. I've been beating up Pokemon and robbing people for the, all all day. We'll go to Drowsy. Oh, I never healed my Parasect. Curses. Um, let's do that now. Superb potion. Blah, 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 blah. Really got to do something with that Spearow. I have a feeling that Spearow is going to gonna like labor behind and I'm gonna just abandon it. Drowsy, wow, nap time. Wha bam Gotcha. Oh no. Good. Don't become a member of the one HP club and like actually kill me like one of them did last time. My chop. He's not gonna use your chop. He's gonna use my chop. Uh, nope, I will not. I just wanted to close the Final Fantasy 15 window. There we go. Uh, diggy hole. Parasect dug a hole. You missed. Oh, okay. With the slither of HP. Go. do so prefer there's nothing in here wait hang on wait how do i open this i can't remember now um i really prefer playing these games on the analog consoles rather than anything else like i it, playing like ps1 games like especially like the resident evil games we played um it does make me very aware that i need a better <laughs> i need a better solution for that where is the switch for this i don't know where the switch is for it Ah, oh, I found a PP up. <laughs> Not a word. <laughs> Oi. Are you dissing Team Rocket? No, I'm just trying to break in and steal your stuff. Uh, oh, wait. Is the switch next to it by any chance? No. <laughs> Deletes the word he was typing. Now I'm curious. Oh, wait, because of PP up. Got it. <laughs> How do... Oh, I just go to here. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no, I forgot about this. Boss said we can see ghosts with the scope. <laughs> cool. Cool story. Uh, team Rockets. Hideout map. Lovely. That's what I want. See, there was none of this growing up. <laughs> Immediately got the the map showing me where everything is. Go Parasect. <clears throat> Excuse me. Body slam the zoo out. What bring you? Coughing. 
Good thing he's telling a random kid that happens to be their headquarters or whatever that is. <laughs> Yeah, I don't think secrets are, are well kept in the um, in Team Rocket, to be honest with you. Oh, I haven't got my thingy on. Have I? Whoops. There we go. Bot's on now. <laughs> Oopsie. No one saw a thing. Um. Parasite is level 28. Parasite is becoming the backbone of this team. I actually might have to swap it out. <laughs> it surpassed Charmeleon. Oh my god. Actually, Raticate is also surpassed Charmeleon. What am I doing? I need my Charizard. Team Rocket telling you their secrets likely. <laughs> likely they're, like they're some sort of Bond villain. I know. Ideas about the station, mate. Uh, it's like someone breaking into your home and going, my boss shared with me that you can save money by dodging taxes in this way. <laughs> oh good, another Zubat. Just what I wanted to see. Uh, Ember. Let me get a bit more comfy. I swear, I've got a little footstool under my desk. And if I am not careful, I'm going to end up... Oh, dear. I'm going to fall asleep if I'm not careful. Jeez, that'll rack in the viewers, won't it? That'll really rake them in. Um, I need to be careful where my feet go, because otherwise I'm going to pull a wire out. <laughs> you won't end up a deer. I'll try not to. Oh, I hit myself in confusion. No! Yeah! Can we come down? <laughs> I don't know if that's the legacy I want. <laughs> I understand it's a legacy I could obtain. I don't know if it's the legacy I really want. Ember, just burn it. Stop being confused. Look, I'm doing it. I'm not confused. Scratch. Confused no more. You patented Kanto insane away. Oh yeah, I hate this. Ooh. Excuse me, this week has caught up with me. Oh boy. With a different name in this game. In this, in this case, Pokemon Sleeper, I suppose. Yeah. I am going to talk about the Gyarados. You gonna die. Used Quick Attack. Immediate. One bite. One bite, no chew, just swallow. Dead. Your rat is dead, mate. <laughs> Your rat is dead and delicious as well. Ooh, trying to Dragon Rage. Yes, absolutely, we'll learn Dragon Rage. Let's give it a splash, because splash is cack. Dragon Rage is the one with the like the typhoon things, isn't it? Beautiful stuff. No chew, just swallow, must resist commenting. Man, if someone's chewing it, phew, geez. that's all I can say. Right, which way do I go here? Oh, I'm on the wrong bit. I'm on the wrong bit of the map. I'm on the wrong bit of the map. There, 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 there. Yep. Uh, oh no, that'll leave me there, and then I can get backwards. Good. Wee. This is the slowest conveyor belt in the world. There we go. Yum, 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 yum. Give me that. Another nugget. Mmm, delicious nuggets. Delish. I've not had chicken nuggets in ages. Ages, ages. What does this go? That goes there. Which is fine. That goes back that way. Uh, I probably just hurl at the end from so much spinning. Yeah, that's true, actually. Don't understand how the conveyor belt can spin you around. Yeah, I don't. There's some weird technology in this. Like, we've got conveyor belts that spin, rotate you and spin you around. Also, what are these for? Like, logically, what are you using them for? Are you using them to move boxes? At which point, why are there not tons of boxes over here? 
Do you know what I mean? Like, I don't understand. What's the motivation for this to be there? <laughs> I'm, looking, I'm digging a bit too deep into this now. Um, but, like, we've got this. We've got the ability to, to shrink animals and capture them in tiny boxes or tiny balls. Um, we've got uh, the ability to store items as data, which is bonkers. And yet we don't have an encyclopedia for Pokemon yet. That that falls to two ten-year-olds to go out and do it because some doddery old uh, gambling Pokemon addict has decided that he can't bother doing it. <laughs> Just a security measure. If you don't know the path, you become the god of Chunder. <laughs> Um, right, let's just go this way. I wasn't even looking them. Oh, this way. That's that way. Good. So that's now that way, back to where I was. That's that way. And that's that way. Does it know where I can go that's not that way? That sounds logical, right? Yeah, that sounded, that sounded like I knew what I was talking about. Um, now I probably want to go down there. Because that will take me there. What's E? He is super potion. There's a superb potion over here. We we what? Uh, right. I gotta go this one. We. Oh, it's all right. It's no rock tunnel. We did the rock tunnel earlier without flash because we are true gamers. We had a gamer pants on. That's what we had. And little claim to fame, I know someone in our chat who who did that before the internet was a thing. Before it was cool. Our very own undeveloped Bruce went through the rock tunnel without flash when they were younger. It took them four hours, but they did it. God damn. We deserve a salute. Now I'm confused. I don't know where I'm going. Uh, I'm going that way and then... Wait, where am I going? <laughs> like, in general, where am I going? <laughs> I'm going to go this way, and I'm going to go this way, and then I'm going that way. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. Good. Good effort. I like it. I like it. Oh, my days. I'm really tired. <sighs> oh, excuse me. Hmm, stairs or lift, stairs or lift. Ooh, the lift actually works, lovely. Uh, let's go with the stairs first. I think this takes me back to where I was a minute ago. Or somewhere near it, anyway. Oh, hello. Why did you come here? Well, I stood on a spinny platform. <laughs> Why did you come here? I wanted free stuff. That's it, that's, that's the only reason. I just wanted some loot. Uh, I will fight you. I will fight you. As if a level 19 Rattata is faster than level 28 Rattata. That's ridiculous. Because that determines who goes first. Rat-Kate? No, I will not. This will be a Kate walk. <laughs> and that I get, because that move always goes first. The tackle? No way. Not on my watch. It. Oh, Hyperfang. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, that's, that's okay. That's not nearly as good as my Rattata's Hyperfang. It's not a contest, but if it was, I'd win. Uh, you're about to use Rattata. No, I will not use Pokemon. I will heal this Pokemon, though. Oh, God, no, that's not heal. Uh, heal. I thought I read that as one. I thought I had one potion left, and I haven't left it. Uh, you used Hyperfang. I'm going to guess that's just as effective as the last time it was used. Yep. And I'm going to use body slam oh good tail whip that's a free move on my part crack you're done <laughs> don't forget kids everything is a nail if the hammer is big enough <laughs> this won't do this won't do at all okay i'll talk take the elevator to see my boss 
I didn't realize this was the point we overthrew Team Rocket quite so quickly. Nope, nothing hidden in the plants there. A Hyperb potion. Hi. Intruder alert. <laughs> <laughs> Rocket wants to fight. Rocket's in a grimer. I love how Rockets always have like the sort of the disgusting Pokemon like Grimer and Coffin. I mean they also have cute ones like Meowth, but you don't see a lot of other something's paralyzed? Oh Grimer's paralyzed as well. Uh you don't see a lot of other specific trainers using those like poison Pokemon. About to use coughing. <laughs> Starts to really like body slam. Ooh, smog. Oh yeah, poison's super effective against Parasect, isn't it? I forgot about that. It's probably not the best Pokemon to have in this fight, but he's he's holding his own. Rocket's about to use coughing. We'll watch the Pokemon. Yes, I'm gonna change it all. Gyarados. Lost Gyarados. And you're gonna use the Oh, I could have used Dragon Rage. I'm not using Dragon Rage for like 5 HP. That's that's super duper super duper dumb. Uh let's just use bite. Ow. -na 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 -na. I can't do it. I can't do it, Captain. Let me just turn this up a bit. There we go. Uh, right, so you... You lot aren't giving me anything, are you? Um, right, so go in here. Where am I going? It appears to need a key. Fantastic. Where is... Oh, God. Where is the key? The key is over there. How do I get there? Four, four. Oh, that's how I go. Oh, wait. No, how do I get there? That's interesting. How do I get there? Oh. Oh. I see. I've gone the wrong way. God bless maps. Canto maps. Good old Canto maps. Is this way. This is how I get my key. Um. I don't, I don't care for that one. Uh, what I do care for is down here, which is this, but I don't know if that's going to... Oh yes, I want that. That's a rare candy. Awesome. And over there is four, and that's what I want. I want to be there. I want to be the very best. Do, 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 do. How do I get there, though? That's the question. That's the six million pound question there, isn't it? I have to be there. Okay, understood. How do I get there? If you can tell me that, that would be fantastic. I can only... Wow, this is that's really confusing. Um, so I have to be on that block in order to go left. So we're up here. Ah, I see, I see. I get it. He's learning. He's learning. Then go this way. Then go this way. There we go. Cool. Now it's this way, I think. No, it's yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. But I gotta get past this trainer as well. Hello. Oh, I didn't need to get past him. I could just snuck past. Stop meddling in Team Rocket's affairs. No! <laughs> Can't be a very well-structured organization if you're taken down by a 10-year-old. I mean, a perfectly tenacious 10-year-old, but a 10-year-old nonetheless. I'm like the Nancy Drew of Pokemon. Uh, body Slam. Crack its body over what I presume is one of your knees. Bane style. That's how I see Body Slam being worked. Uh, no? I need to pay attention to what is on the screen, because I'm not. Cut. 
Oof, damn. Right, that's you taken care of. Now, have you got another one? I can't remember. You do. It's a drowsy, though. No, I won't change Pokemon, but I am going to heal this one. Uh, superb potion. Made in Kento. Hypnosis, but it didn't affect Paris. Parasect, even. Uh, body slam. Oh, I'm running out of um, move points. I'm running out of PP. Pee -pee. I don't have enough PP. Pee -pee. Oof, taken down. Taken down. Cut down in your prime. What's this? Nothing. What's this? Tape spools. Otherwise. Uh, so now I need there. And then I need to go this way. Because I think it's. It's this one. Oh, this, this doofus has it. Got it. No more in items. Of course it's not. What is that item? That item is a... Oh, it's a TM. It's Razor Wind. Am I... Oh, God, no. That's a sepia tone. I might actually want that. Um, what can I get rid of? Oh, nothing. Oh, PP up. Use this. Use it on Paris. Raise PP at Body Slam. Lovely. Uh, there's also an HP up as well, I think. I have, yeah. HP, that'll do. Um, I'm going to use this. Who has the lowest HP? It is actually Charmeleon. Yeah. And now. Let's use this. Oh, that's an elixir, not an ether. This moonstone, just toss it. I'm never going to use a moonstone at all. And what is TM7? I can't remember. Horn drill. I'm gonna guess no one's on that. Uh, keep that though because it's gonna be expensive. TM2, Razor Wind. I make it sound like I know. I know that just off, off of the top of my head. I don't. It's on the screen. <laughs> the elevator doesn't work. Who has the lift key? I wonder, Jeffrey, who has the lift key? If only we could interrogate every single person in this place. Give me the fucking lift key. Uh, right, you sent out coughing. Good. Oh, I still got Parasite to start to That's fine. Parasite is doing a bang up job. Oh, so it's plus the ray to the PP on that move. That's pretty cool. Body slam again. Crack. Dump. Are you about to know Zubar? Bless you. <laughs> Body slam. <laughs> Snap it over your shell. A well deserved spinal break, I think. Mike defeated a rocket. No. Talk to him again. Oh no, I dropped the lift key. Because unless you talk to them again, you wouldn't know that it had the they had the lift key. Uh what's in this room? This room is an HP up. I love that. Thanks very much. There's no there's no wild Pokemon around here. I will also use that as well, because now I think I'm out of room again. Don't know why I can't eat my nuggets. Right, so now we need to get back to the lift which means we need to I am going to guess this way because it's the only other way we can go oh no I could have gone that way which leads me the same way actually so that's not too bad yes good 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 so back up here which leads me to this person yeah fantastic and now I just need to remember how to get to the lift again which I think was this way I think Ow. Sorry. And now... I don't know. It's... You're back. And now watching the spinning while moving around, reminding me of the theatre part of Final Fantasy VII. Oh, that's such a good bet. Have you played the remake, Cadmus? I'm very interested. Oh, they spin off stage. Oh, I remember. I loved the golden sauce when I was when I was young. Not yet. It's very good. It's very, very good. 
from a lifelong Final Fantasy VII fan is very good. Heartily recommended. I was so worried that it was going to be terrible until recently it hadn't come out of PC so I couldn't... Oh, I see, I see, I see. That makes sense. That would have been a system seller for me. Actually, I think that might have been a system seller for me. I think that might be the reason I got... Oh, no, I had it on PS4, didn't I? I'm, I'm crazy. What did I get PS5 for? There will have been something I got a PS5 for, other than it just being new shiny. Oh, Crisis Core. The Crisis Core um, remake for PS5. That was what I got it for. Dewey, Bruce, Dewey spin you right round? That's good to know. I didn't even... I don't know what I pressed then. That's a Zach one. Yeah, that's a Zach one. And in fact, that was really beneficial to play because it's it felt like the remake. So we played that. I say we. I played it and my wife watched sometimes. Um, and then we played the remake, the Final Fantasy VII remake. So because it all felt a bit similar, if that makes sense. The Crisis Core remake, though, it fit. You feel like it's a club. A PlayStation Vita or PlayStation Portable, I forget which, uh, a handheld game um, remade and remastered. It's got very repetitive combat style, but you just kind of overlook that. I want, I kept wanting to just get to the next bit. I was very much pushing the character from A to B, like just get, get to the thing now, if that makes sense. Get to the next story bit, which was fine because I was very invested in the story. I wanted to know what happened, so because it's one of those things in the original Final Fantasy VII that we really kind of always glossed over. It's disabled. No. Um, PSP, which I didn't play until much later with an emulator. I never had a PSP. Well, that's not true. I did have a PSP, but I didn't have any games for it. Um, I had, I got a, a PSP given to me from a relative because um, they, they were never going to use it. P PSP, yeah. Um, they bought it, they had it for a few weeks and they never used it. So they were like, do what you want with it. So I was like, okay, cool. I've never got any games for it, but I used to use it as like an emulator machine. So I used to play like uh, Game Boy and Game Boy Advance games on it, <laughs> which I thought was really cool because I used to at nights as well. So that was that was a godsend for me. I used to play um, Final Fantasy V and VI a lot. Which was one of my one of my go-to games whenever I wanted to uh, just just get through a night shift. That and Secret of Mana. There's a there's a theme here. I think mean, you can see. I try to learn spore. What does spore do? Are there any are there any trash moves that Parasite knows? Does Parasite have any trash moves? No, I don't need it. What's what is spore? Is spore a good move? Let's have a look. Pokemon Balloon move Spore. Spore move. Gen 1? Spore was a great game. I don't, I don't know. I never played it. Uh, accuracy is 100. That's good. Um, just show me what it does. Special spores scattered from mushrooms. If the opponent inhales the spores, it will fall asleep. So it's just asleep. A, a sleepy one. That's fine. Post target sleep. Thank you, Katniss. Uh, then I'm going to say no, because Stun Spore is a pretty decent move, I'll be honest with you. Um, so no to that one. Yes. Did not land Spore. Why? But why? Right, I just need to, before we forcefully induce nap, I had one of those yesterday. I had a headache. Oh man, did I have a headache. I was um, unboxing, finally unboxing and putting together. If you saw it on the Discord, you know what I'm talking about. Um, but finally unboxing and putting together some of the figurines in the um, Warhammer Quest Cursed City game that I got uh, months ago. Um, but you, because, oh no, you're, you're injured, aren't you? Um, is there, are you antidote good thank you Whoa. um long story tldr i used to play 
Warhammer Fantasy, back when it was Warhammer Fantasy, um, with uh, my uncle. And I've not been back into Warhammer since, like, at all. Uh, but I saw Warhammer Quest, we used to play Warhammer Quest a lot. And uh, I saw this, because uh, that was probably my first pseudo introduction to Dungeons and Dragons. Um, which one won't be two? Sure, why not? I think that might be the one I was on originally. Um, so I saw this, I got an intro to the game in the shop and played a couple of rounds and stuff like that. And I kind of wanted to get back into model painting. I mean, I know it's going to be a, a another hobby, right? If that makes sense. It's going to be an, another thing that I'm passionate about. But it's going to... I'd like to be able to paint them well, if that makes sense. Are you both trainers? No. Um... So yeah, so but I got the the box set ages ago, and I didn't open it um, until last night. I started putting some of the heroes together, and they have this weird like um, glueless tech. They just click together, which I really appreciate. I gotta admit, but I would genuinely thought that I would just need to um, uh, like clip and glue things. I was so so used to like gluing stuff around with iron. I was so used to like gluing stuff um, that I just what 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 is iron? What does iron do? Cool. Let's use iron on Charmeleon. It defends Rose. Fantastic. So it's like PP up or HP up. Fantastic. Just gonna genetically modify my Pokemon. Get out of the way. Oi! How can you not see the beauty about evil? <laughs> Who says I don't? I'm just here. I'm here stage a coup. Yeah, it was so, such a long time. I was just like, I don't want to do any like figurine painting because I would do it really badly. And I know people would paint them really well. But last night, it was somewhat weird about last night. I was just like, no, I'm going to stop putting them together. And then maybe at Christmas, either I will ask for a starter kit for paint or I'll get a starter kit for paint or I'll get myself one or whatever. Um, and uh, no, I don't want to switch the pop I will give it a go because that's the only way I'm going to learn. It's the only way I'm going to learn it is if I just give it a go. Used dig. I'm going to assume that's not. It's more impressive than I thought it would be. That's more effective than I imagined. Oh, my right foot is so in a bunch of wires right now. This could be the end of it. Sorry, something could fail at the minute. <laughs> my cable management game is not existent these days. Arbok, did you know that's Cobra backwards? Always that one person. I dug a hole. <laughs> you bit a hole. I didn't think that move could miss. Oh, poison sting gets fucking Ben. You poop. A lesson neither I nor anyone, it seems, could ever impart on my father. Often the best way to learn something is by trying to do it. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not going to be naturally good at it. Because many, 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 many years ago, I used to paint um, Space Marines. I used to paint Warhammer 40k Space Marines. I did that just in case you don't know what Space Marine is, because obviously that's indicative of what Space Marine is. Tiny man. Um... Unless failure can cause someone's death, there isn't much harm in trying. Exactly. Uh, and I remember being god-awful. But it didn't stop me. Do you know what I mean? I know you. You ruined our plans at Mount Moon. Will it be the greatest thing ever? No. Will you learn from it? Definitely. I also thought to myself, if it's really bad, I'm certain there's a way of getting paint off. Like, I'm certain there's a way of removing the paint from the model. And if it's really, really bad, then I just don't have to use that model, surely. Sand sure is paralyzed. How dare you not be paralyzed, you fuck. He's always afraid of everything. Oh, bless. In fairness, I used to be like that. I did, I, there was, I, I didn't want to try anything new because I, I have a massive fear of failure. Like a humongous fear of failure. I think just because of some of the stuff that's happened in my life, everything had to go right. Because um, if it didn't, it was it was it was a big thing, basically. Um, that's a that's a marker of um, 
uh, child abuse. <laughs> that's, what, that's what that is. I was I was certain that if something went wrong, it would be my fault. There you go. That's what I've learned in therapy over the last few years. Uh, but, but yeah, it, 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 not everything is needs to be perfect. Do you know what I mean? Like I am, like I said, with the with the streaming setup. I desperately need to do something about it because it's a bit of a mess, but it works. Do you know what I mean? And I don't think it's a bad setup at the moment. So. But yeah, with the painting models, it's something I've never done before. Are you even doing anything, Paris? Paris, like, there we go. <laughs> Hello, boy. Good boy. Look at you go. Um, yeah, with the painting models, I think I'm just like constantly like, oh, I'm going to do a bad job and it's going to be terrible. Yeah, probably, but that's okay. Do you know what I mean? Like that's, I need I need to tell myself that. I need to really believe that, that that's okay. And I've not ruined anything. And I've not destroyed anything. It's just, that's, that's what it is. Rocket is about to use Sand Slash. I will actually swap out now. Um, because I'm going to swap for Raticate. Who knows a water move? Who's going to destroy you? Look at your little face. Uh, water gun. It's super effective. It doesn't look it. Ow. <laughs> it took off like a third of my health. Which is the fear of the uncertain or unknown life needing detailed instructions on how to use an app or fill out a form weeks in advance because if what if he does something like ask to create an account with a password or a pin oh no let me obsess for a week or two about what password or pin i can use i just can't make one up on the spot that seems it seems like that would be difficult a difficult way of now i'm not saying i don't i don't also do that with regards to some stuff like but like, I, I can understand, especially where that's. Oh, good, thank you. Um, especially where that's coming from, that must be that must be quite difficult. Just heal Parasect and Rad Kate, because we're about to fight Giovanni. Yeah, full full heals, not half heals. Alright, giggles. How are you doing? So, I must say, I'm impressed. Look up here. I don't know why he's got that voice. <laughs> you look like the bad guy at the end of Streets of Rage. Giovanni sent out Onyx. Oh, I'm going to send out Parasect on that. Yeah, that's probably not the greatest one, but it is what it is. So, Stun Spore. Use Guard Spec on Onyx. How dare you? Paralyze it. Good. Now just swap you out for Rag here a second, because you Rag it has the, the tools for this. Used Rock Throw. Ow. <laughs> you dick. <laughs> I always imagine the rock that Onyx throws is like the last rock of his tail or something like that. You fainted. Good. Parasite Google level 31. Guys, he's a, he's a strong boy now, isn't he? Um, Rhyhorn. Uh, what was Rhyhorn? Was Rhyhorn ground? Ground normal? I can't remember. Uh, no, I'll stick with that. I mean, unless there are serious consequences like monetary loss or something, it could be, it could be a bit frightening, but that's just life in general. Don't know what the settings button does. What sort of settings will it show? Option A, press it in C. Option B, close the app and never use it again. I see. I see. We were having a similar conversation about food recently. Um, that I've become. I have no problem saying that I'm a terrible cook. And I am. I'm genuine. I need. I'm not a terrible cook. I've recognized my cooking style, which is not the cooking style of other people. Um, I need very clear instructions and I need just a little bit of time, five or ten minutes just to measure out everything that I'm going to be using I, 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 what I lack in creativity in the kitchen, I make up for in other places like entertaining you, my book but 
um, I let's just hyperfine this to death. I need to know, you know, if it's going to be a tablespoon of paprika in this recipe. It's a tablespoon of paprika. Maybe it's a little bit over. Yeah, maybe it's a little bit under. But it's a tablespoon. It's not just like, oh, I'll just pour some in until I think a tablespoon is in there. Now, I know people who can do that very, very well. I just don't. I don't have the confidence to do that. And I think I have to accept the fact, or I have accepted the fact that I don't have that level of confidence in the kitchen. Use guard spec on Kangas. How dare you? Um, Hyperfang did okay. But for me, it's less about sort of, oh, I don't I don't want to do that because I might get it wrong, which it always used to be. Um, or I'd apologise. Like, I'd make food in the bar. Oh, sorry, this isn't great. Sorry, this isn't this. I'm just like, that's the best. Now I'm like, no, this is this is cooked food. Do you know what I mean? Uh, and that's fine. Some care is acceptable, but eventually you have to pull the trigger and actually try it instead of freezing it up and doing nothing ever. I agree that you should do stuff that scares you. I don't agree that with the people who say, like, oh, do one thing every day that terrifies you. No. <laughs> who has time for that? Like, don't shy away from the things that scare you. I see that you raise Pokemon with, uh, with utmost care. A child like you would never understand what I hope to achieve. I shall step aside this time. I hope we meet again. Thanks, mate. Cheers. Bye. Back to Lavender Town. Can I dig my way out of here now? Yes, I can. Excellent. Technically a dungeon. Perfect. Dun, 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 dun. It's never going to get old. Yeah, I think probably what I need to start doing is um, leveling up some of my Pokemon outside of stream. Because I know that's not a fun bit to watch. But keep away from, keep out of Team Rocket's way. Go fuck yourself. <laughs> uh, I know that's not exactly a fun bit to watch. But I also know I don't want to just abandon this. I don't want this to be like an abandoned series or anything like that. Because I've had enough of those in the past. I actually want to see this to the end. Um, is this the tunnel? Yeah, this is all. But in order to do that, we will probably have times when uh, I come back and I'm like, so here's what happened while you were away. <laughs> it's not like, oh, I got too much in badges. It's, it's just been more like, oh, these Pokemon leveled up three times. Oh, what? All right, let's roll the dice. Okay, I could do it with the money, to be honest. Um... Yeah, that's probably what I'm trying to do next week. If I have time, who knows? I got lots, lots of things planned. While you're away, I finished this game. Yeah. What I definitely don't want to do, which I think is a bit of a cop out, and I see, I do see people do this quite a lot, um, is start a game on stream, but then finish it on YouTube, and I'm like, that just feels dirty. Do you know what I mean? Like, oh, episode one live on Twitch, episode two of twenty six, you know on YouTube now, go like, share, and subscribe. <laughs> uh, will you change Pokemon? No. I won't change Pokemon. Body slam! I need to move my camera. That's what I need to do. Oh, that's why my camera was there last time! Because I was playing it like this, wasn't I? I was playing it like this. Parasite fell asleep. How dare you? Get up. Right, okay. Chew it to death. Oh, what? Racket woke up. Excellent. <laughs> Hyperfang. <laughs> Poly whirl. Uh, no, I'm good. Hyperfang. Thanks. Yeah, they deserve a break. Oh, I used Hyper Fang on a one HP Pokemon. I'm such a numpty. Raticate grew to level 30! 30! I came up short. Well, I didn't, thanks. Ka-ching! 
Uh, I don't remember if there's a trainer right here, actually. I still, I don't remember what's, like, you can fuck off. Uh, I don't remember what's in this patch of grass. This is route eight, isn't it? Isn't it? Near, just outside Celadon. Where's my map? Uh, Celadon? Celadon. Oh, this is route seven. Right, what's on route seven? Route seven Pokemons. I actually wrote Pokemons as well. Who, who knew? Um, what have we got? Gen 1. We've got Pidgey, Pidgey, Pidgeotto, Rattata, Vulpix. I just noticed they changed the emo to add a carrot nose to the cat. Kek oh, I see. <laughs> so they did. <laughs> I never noticed that. Um, Jigglypuff, Oddish, Meowth, Mankey, Ugh. Growlithe, Abra, and Bellsprout. That's what's in there. So that's, I mean, if you were if you were playing this casually, um, not like we're playing it t for, for a tournament, but if you're playing it normally, like this would be a, ooh, these are rare Pokemon that you can't find in most other places. Um... It didn't need to be like that. It must be a recent change. I think it's a recent change. Uh, there's a Pokemon Center here, right? 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 Good, thanks. Yeah, who knows if I'll be able to level up um, next week. Out of, uh, out of stream, I have a lot of very exciting stuff planned for the new year for the channel. And it's not the... Um, oh, that's the sepia tone again. It's not that I'm overstretching myself. I just I want to I want to do I want to do it right. If that makes sense, I don't want to do like impulse stuff like I normally do. So when I have an idea, I like I sit on it for a bit, and then I'm like, okay, let's let's try this, and let's try that, and let's try the other. <laughs> I just I kind of hope that it's you know I'm a, I'm a plans man now. I've got plans and projects and all that sort of all that sort of good stuff. What's oh, ghastly? Oh, I can see the ghosts now. Fantastic. Um, I mean, if I can catch it, I'm definitely going to have a spooky boy in my in my squad. Um, how? Oh, will Dig kill you? I'm not sure if Dig will kill you. I'm 11 levels higher than you. It's entirely possible. You missed. Wabosh. Yeah, he killed me. Damn it. Also, I've only got regular Pokeballs. I've not got good Pokeballs. So, I might need to come back and capture a spooky boy. Unless one just happens to allow me to not kill it immediately which I think with Parasect is going to be a limited amount mm. that was the wrong move that was the wrong move dig a hole, lick a hole Excellent, there we go. Let's start with it sorted. Now, right. <laughs> this is the thing about them no longer being ghosts, but being ghosts. <laughs> 23? You might survive the, the. Dig a hole, then do what's that? Lick a hole. Dig a hole, lick a hole. Because um, I dug and Ghastly used lick, but they missed, which means they licked the hole. <laughs> Come on, keep up, Camus. <laughs> What was the what was the term we used to use? Drop it, flop it, and pop it, or something like that. See, use lick. If I hadn't dug a hole in, I'm now paralyzed. Fantastic. Am I going to be paralyzed underground as well? Confused, right? I'm also confused. God damn it! <laughs> dig again. <laughs> no wonder they died. <laughs> you are confused, and you hurt yourself in confusion again. Come on, I'm gonna give you one more chance. It's confused no more. Parasect dug a hole. Ghastly licks. They missed because Parasect's in a hole. Use dig. No, that killed it immediately. Curses. <laughs> ah well, that was a, 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 a valiant effort. A cubone. Definitely don't want a cubone. A cubone will just make me sad. Run, please. I don't really want to have to fuck around with that. 
superb potion. Oh, I've got two super potions. Now I've technically got one. Damn it. Right. Cheeky save. Cheeky save. I need that to become a thing. I might need an emote for that. Cheeky save. If I paralyze you, right, will that help me catch you? I'm confused, and I hurt myself in the confusion. Fuck's sake, Parasect. Oh, and I'm still paralyzed as well. I'm now still paralyzed and confused. I'm confused no more. I used stun sport, it didn't affect it. Right, go away. Go on, peace off. Let me get to the, the safety plate. That bit. Let me get here. I want to go here. Ah, lovely. Enter the purification zone. Fantastic. So we're all healed. Oh, wait. Were you there a minute ago? Give me your soul. I must have gone round the other way earlier. Channeler wants to fight. Channeler, not Hunter. Go, Parasect. You know what to do, Parasect. Kill them. Kill them all. Dig their graves and bury them alive. Confuse Ray, but it failed. Parasite, use Dig. And destroyed Haunter. <laughs> that makes me feel like, because Haunter was level 23, if I've got that Ghastly at level 23, it would have immediately become a Haunter. Which makes me feel a little sad. Because I, I really like Gengar, so... <laughs> it's gonna happen. Parasect? No. Thanks, though. Bye. <laughs> So now we're up here, which I don't... Yeah, we've been up here, good. Oh, curses. <laughs> oh look, another ghost. Run! Oh, <laughs> Ooh, a haunter. A level 26 Haunter. Right, let's use Dig on you and see if you die immediately. Used Lick. Oh, good, I'm now paralyzed. I am fully paralyzed, I can't move. Used Lick again. I'm still as paralyzed as I was, but I did dig a hole this time, which is good. God damn, Dig is good against Ghost Pokemon. Jeez. Wow. I didn't I never realize Dig was that effective. Another haunter. Another level 26 haunter. I feel like it's taunting me to catch this Pokemon. I'm gonna try and catch this one. Um what can I use? Let's use Raticate's water gun. You couldn't move yet somehow dug a hole. Yeah, it's selective paralysis, I've noticed. Uh, they're all normal, that's water. Right, okay, he's confused, and it hurt itself in the confusion, because of course it did. Water gun, you are confused, but you used water gun. Excellent, that's a critical hit, is it? That, that was a crit. Jeez. That was a non-crit. Right, okay, he's confused. It hurt itself in the confusion. Right, okay, he's fucked. He's gonna have to use mine. No, I'm not going to have to use that. I'm going to have to swap out. Swap out for Charming Leon. Charming Leon. Swap out for Charming Leon. Use Nightshade. I still just have terrible Pokeballs as well, though, don't I? So I'll be very surprised if it lets me catch or anything. Charming Leon is confused, but uses Ember. Oh, God. Awful. Confuse Ray, but it failed because I'm already confused, fucker. <laughs> Use Nightshade, which is a decent move, I'll be honest. I'm confused, and I hurt myself in confusion. Don't, don't off yourself in the confusion, mate. Uh, Gyarados, I guess. This Hornet is picking me apart. Picking me apart. Nightshade. I'm going to have to use Thunderbolt because it's the only non, like... It's the only move I've got. Thunderbolt. Oh, good. Fantastic. Right. Pokeball. Quick. Pokeball. 
Damn it. We got one wobble. One wobble. Let's try again. Pokeball. Again, one wobble. I think if I do another Thunderbolt, another Thunderbolt, I'm going to kill it. Another one wobble. I'm going to press the C button. The C button? I'm on a SNES controller, mate. <laughs> I'll smash the A button. It fucking works. Haunter was caught. Lovely. Welcome to the team, Haunter. The gas Pokemon. Because of its ability to slip through block walls, it is said to be from another dimension. Your Game Boy didn't have a C button. No, I had an A and a B button. I'm pretty sure the Game Boy didn't. I'm pretty sure we didn't have a C button. UK Game Boy. No, not Game Boy Mod. Why are you auto-completing that? I don't I don't think I've ever looked for that. Uh yep, no, just A and B. Just A and B. It did not have it. Definitely did not have a C button. It's wild that a Game Boy would have a C button. <laughs> Do you want to give it a name to Honza? No, I don't think so. Uh, now. Yeah, I'm going to head back. Because <laughs> I just got ripped to pieces by Honza. That bloody channel is right my way, aren't they? Um, it didn't have well and start, I suppose, and D-pad and select. Yeah, it had A, B, start, select, power dial, uh, power, volume, that sort of thing. D-pad. Right, cool. We're all healed. Lovely. Now, if only one of you were selling potions, that would be real helpful. But yeah, no C button. I didn't realize there were models of the Game Boy that had a C button. Right, here we go. Right, cheeky save. Cheeky save. They're gone, intruders. You don't think there are? Why did you, why did you mention a sea button? Reveal the ghost's identity. It's a Marowak. Uh, I'm going to use Body Slam. Focus energy. Body Slam. <laughs> body Slam. <laughs> uh, I was very surprised the first time I saw a controller with a C button, the Mega Drive slash Genesis. Yep. Do you know what used to blow my mind? The um, Mega Drive 6 button controller. Proper blew my mind when I first saw that. I was like, why would you possibly need that many buttons? Parasite grew to level 32. Parasite is a fucking beast right now. The ghost was the restless soul of Cubone's mother. The mother's soul was calmed. It departed to the afterlife. Cool. I don't... What the fuck are you lot doing here? Uh, Alright. Come here. What do you want? What are you doing? I'm here to ruin your day, mate. I was always confused as to the difference between each row of triplets. I think, no, I could be wrong, they made the six-button controller for a beat-em-up game. I think it was Eternal Champions. I can't fully remember, but I'm pretty sure they only used it for that beat-em-up game. And then the rest of them were like, we've got A, B, and C, and A, B, and C. If you just use six buttons, I mean, there's not a lot we can help. There's not a lot we can do with that. We're making this for a three-button controller. I loved how funky the buttons were, and people who know, you know what I mean when I say funky, right? They were proper duk, 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 duk buttons. Parasite is confused. They were good feeling buttons. Used supersonic, but it failed. Parasite is confused, and it hurt itself in the confusion. Can you not be quite so crap? Parasite. <laughs> confused no more. Fantastic. Thank you. Thanks, mate. 
A Golbat. Ooh, I've always wanted to body slam a Golbat. Golbat looks cursed. It does not look like a good, a good version of Golbat. I hurt myself in the confusion. Of course I did. Golbat, you screech. And my defense greatly fell. I am confused. But I used body slam. And... Oh, I didn't kill it. Golbat clearly has more defense than I thought. I mean, not enough, but more. Parasix has just become the powerhouse of this team. You know, I'm not going to forget this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See you later. There you go, Chuckles. Oh, God. I forgot there were wild Pokemon up here. I don't need you. I got a Haunter now. Uh, no, I'm good. Thanks, bye. <laughs> right, let me just um, cheeky heal as well. Right, that'll do for now. Ooh, I'm excited to use Haunter. This old guy came and complained about us harming useless Pokemon. We're, ta we're talking it over as adults. Mm, you're not going to lie. There was a, there's a glitch here somewhere. <laughs> Yes, heal thy cheeks. <laughs> uh, body slam. It's just, it's a go-to move. I just, it's a bit repetitive, but it's a go-to move. It's super effective. Uh, oh, that was you poisoning me. Okay. Which is fair enough, because I'm a bug Pokemon, so Parasect is a bug Pokemon. A drowsy. The same thing I am. I hope I sleep so well tonight. I'm so looking forward to it now. Oh, stun spoil. That's fine. We can live without stun spoil this time. Uh, use cut because I don't. Oh, dang. 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 Good. Thank you. I was like, please don't leave it with one HP. I'll be so mad if it leaves it with one HP. Please, no more. Pokemon are only good for making money. Stay out of our business. How do you make money out of Pokemon? Like, that would be a really painful procedure, surely. Ow. Antidote. There you go. Right, I think Parasect might be not long for this world. Uh, you're not saving anyone, kid. Rocket wants to fight. Rocket sent out Zubat. Go Parasect. Body slam. <laughs> Immediate opening volley of body slams. How does it go before me? I'm nearly 10 levels higher than it. That's ridiculous. Ridiculous, that's what that is. Rasa, nope. <laughs> I am not swapping anything. Excellent. Parasect is once again flexing. Raticate, no. I really wish the Pokemon got healed when they leveled up. That would be so useful. Body slam. Oh. Do a, a good old fashioned cut. I can't believe my dexterity is that high. My uh, evasion is that high. Zubat. No, I will not change Pokemon. Thanks, though. And Body Slam. Excellent stuff. Cool. Get out of here. Go on, fuck off. On your bike, mate. Uh, don't fight those rockets. You're not getting away with this. Yeah, I kind of am though. So, hello, Mr. Fuji. Huh? You came to save me. Oh, thank you. But I came here out of my own free will. I came to calm the soul of Cubone's mother. I think Marowak's spirit has gone to the afterlife. I must thank you for your kind concern. Follow me to my home, Pokemon House, at the foot of this tower. 
Hi. Mr. Fuji, you've been praying alone for Cubone's mother. It's so warm. Pokemon are so nice to hug. <laughs> I can imagine Snorlax gives good hugs. Mike, your Pokedex quest may fail without love for your Pokemon. I think that this may help your quest. I received a Poke Flute. I've completely forgotten what- Oh, that's what that's for. Upon hearing Poke Flute, sleeping Pokemon will spring awake. It works on all sleeping Pokemon. Thanks, mate. Bye. <laughs> Okay, so we got a flute, so now we click up Snorlax, which means we can go to... I forgot where I'm going now. I think Vermilion City, because I think it's on the road there. Or it's, it might be south of Lavender. I'm not 100% certain. But what I am certain, Snorlax doesn't hug. At best, it doesn't snore. <laughs> At best, it doesn't snore, but it just naps. I aspire to be a Snorlax one day. Snorlax is... Yeah, I agree. Snorlax is a good way of being. Uh, yeah, I desperately need some more super potions. I have a ten super potions for too much money. It was me saying earlier, only like seven eight or something like that. <gasps> super repels. I'm gonna buy a couple of those actually, because there are times when we do want to just. I can't carry any more items. Of course I can't. Sell my nuggets. <laughs> we'll talk about only guns again. Um, yep, yeah, there we go. Uh, no, I don't. I don't want to sell my bike. Thanks though. So, I'll keep that, keep that, keep that. That's uh, awakening. X accuracy. I'm never going to use that. Ever. I'll never use it. Rare candy. Escape probe. I have dig on a really good Pokemon, so no. Oh, wait. Was there two there? No. Rare candy. Uh, the, yeah, I'm going to use both of those. Yeah, okay, cool. So, buy some. Nope. Super repels. Lovely. Natalie. 